Stefan, there's a very interesting poster behind you, and it's got a word which I can't pronounce. Stain hard, stanny hard. What does it mean? It's uh, stainy hard. It's uh, uh, surface hardening of stainless steel, uh, which is not uh, possible uh, to do by normal uh, techniques uh, because it's an austenitic stainless steel normally cannot be hardened. Why is surface treatment important? Uh, because when, when, when you're using stainless steel um, and the product cannot be hardened, uh, the, uh, the, the, the steel is too soft and when you are using it and in some applications you have the cold welding or fretting which is well known in, in users of the stainless steel and also the wear resistance is very low. Okay, I understand there are other techniques for surface treatment. What makes Stainy Hard so special? Uh, Stainy Hard is based on classical nitrocarburizing, but when you're using the, the classical treatment or when you're using uh, competitive treatments, uh, in almost every uh, uh, competing uh, technique, the surface uh, uh, corrosion resistance is uh, reduced, and with Stainy Hard it remains or is even improved. I know you spent a lot of time and effort in developing this technique. What's the response been from the market? Well, there's a lot of response from the market. Um, we have uh, 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 questions for uh, quotations uh, from uh, all over the world. And uh, yeah, there's a lot of, lot of response from the market. They are interesting in, uh, in this process. And it, from these interested parties, do they have to come to you in Eindhoven to get this uh, technique applied? Yes, uh, the, the, the stainy hard treatment is only carried out in, uh, in Eindhoven. Um, maybe in some years' time we will do it in uh, other uh, companies in the Albers Industries Group, but at this time, is at this time only in, uh, in Eindhoven. So it's an interesting treatment, it's an innovative treatment. You're very positive about its future? I'm very positive uh, about the future. There's a lot of response from the market, so uh, I'm quite optimistic, yes.